All right. All right, we're back on the road. I'm just not getting in my groove right now. We chose to come out on rush hour day right now. A rush hour traffic right now. And I hate it more than anything. And I want to lane split so badly right now. I don't know why I do this to myself. I had all morning to come out and I did not. And now that I time, the time that I choose to come out, it is just rush hour, rush hour, rush hour traffic. And I just, I hate it. I really hate it. I despise it right now. I despise myself right now. So a good thing is that we can shift into neutral without any issues. That's the good part. Bad part is that I'm just, I'm lost without mirrors right now. I like to know what's happening in my surroundings. That's the ADHD part of me where I'm just looking around all the time. Now I can't look at what's happening behind me. It's just throwing me off, man. Uh, new levers, bike stall service and nice and clean and perfect, running amazing. We can shift into neutral without any problems. Washer down, detail the entire bike. Um, gonna get the wrap started soon, so I'm gonna have to wash it again, but I won't have to detail it this time. Um, we're gonna wrap a panel by panel. Last time when I, Wrap the R6 Kakarot in gold chrome, Super Saiyan gold chrome. I don't know how long it took me. I think it I took like uh, two weeks, I want to say I did it. And that was because I was on a time crunch because of had this stuff happening in my life. And this time I have more time on my hands. So I want to take my time with each of the panels, not rush anything, and uh, see where that goes. Also, I'm not wearing my jacket today because it was supposed to be a short ride. So I'm just, I'm out of my element today. I'm still wearing leathers below. You guys see the boots and everything, but not having everything on is just throwing me off like crazy right now it's throwing me off like crazy right now and not in a good way i feel funky i feel sweaty i feel ugly all a bunch of emotions are running through my body right now that i'm not i'm not i'm not vibing with right now just turn green for god's sake just turn green all right oh, i feel so good i was supposed to turn but it just feels so good the wind feels so nice why didn't i turn <laughs> oh my god school is getting out isn't it yeah school's getting out oh my god slapped me so hard in the face are they fighting i wish they threw a fist man i wish someone threw a fist that would have been hilarious just throw a fist man call it a day Oh my god, look at all those humans. 20 second long, man. I wish I'd do it in the cycle, just ran everybody over. One thing I never understood is people walk in their cycles. Doesn't that defeat the purpose? Pretty much actually that defeats the purpose. That kid's humping a stick over there. Pretty gross. What you looking at, girl? Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D., what does that mean? Isn't that that TV show? Whatever happened to Supreme? That chick had a sticker, a bumper sticker, or a side sticker, a door sticker, whatever happened to Supreme. It used to be all over the place, and now you barely even hear about it. Could go up ahead, but I might as well just turn here, man. I got my promiscuous girl playing right now, and that's not that's not that's not the vibe at all. But I can't change the song track because the, the buttons, the controls to change on this helmet is on the very back. Ah oh my god, I miss my Senna. I wonder if I can get my Senna included in this. I never thought of that. But I could just rip off this Rurock Atlas shockwave bull crap and put some Senna in this instead. Never thought of that, just thought of it. We'll do it now. We'll 100% do it now. That fat chick in the car was staring at me and she licked her lips. But I'm pretty sure she also bought food. So it could be that, that she was looking to list for a different reason. 
I don't want to listen to Promiscuous Girls. See, and I have to take my glove off. See? I have to take my glove off to change the goddamn track. How the goddamn way do you change the track on here? Yeah, I don't know how to change the track. I don't know how to change the track on this thing. I thought you were supposed to press it twice, press it once, lick it, spit on it. Eh, yeah, nothing where it happens. My hands are all sweaty, so I can't put my gloves on. Who the hell designed this ad shockwave bullcrap on a Rurock? Oh my god, we're gonna remove this or we're gonna get a center. This is such garbage. Such garbage. Never had more of a garbage system on his bike. Or a part of my riding experience. This is just such garbage. This chick, she was looking at her lips and she, oh, there's a dog in there. I love you, dog. More than anything, roll your window up. Roll your window up. She likes it, don't you? She likes it. Lips licked. Dog him, fuck him, love him, leave him, cause I fucking need him. Both Kia riders or drivers, look at how one drives it, look at the other one drives it. Yeah, I gotta, the clutch is such out there, man, I gotta fix this. Yeah, today's not the ride I was expecting. I was expecting happiness, smiles, and marshmallows, rainbows all around, but it just ain't like that. See, I'm speeding right now, but I don't know if I should be fearful for my life. Oh my God. But we got Jay-Z Big Pimpin playing right now. I was not paying attention. I was looking at the other. I was looking at the other um, traffic light. I don't know there was one over here. Thank God this got braked. Oh, I'm so, I'm skinny now. Really skinny now. Someone's smoking. It up. So she can fit through lane swing stuff so much more easily because she's skinny. But once we have the mirror, she probably won't be able to do it again. But yeah, see, beautiful, amazing road that I would just blaze it on, man. I just blaze it on, man. But I don't know what's around. I don't know what's around. I got music playing, but I can barely hear it because Broly is so stupidly loud. But one thing I love about it is that she's so loud, but she's bone stock, man, performance-wise. She's bone stock. So I wish somebody would have with me, man, about having a loud exhaust. OEM, son, OEM. Oh, I love that homie. He has a little bicycle, electric bike or whatever, riding with a dirt bike helmet. I have with that. I do the same exact thing. I wouldn't wear that kind of helmet. I wear a full freaking motorcycle helmet, homie. They make it for kids, so why not? Is that a girl or a boy? Can't tell. I think it's a boy. Homie. Homie. Run, homie. Blazing. Look at me, man. I'll look at you. Look at me, man. I love that's the neon wheels that I want for Broly. Man, everybody has them goddamn e-bikes now. Oh, he's getting chased. They're trying to see who's faster. That dude's still hauling booty. Oh, I thought that guy was me, if you guys know what I mean. But he's not. But it's cool, I love him. He won't look at me, though. Maybe because he looked at me, and I was looking at him. See, I won't even applaud that. I wouldn't even want to get any attention, but the reason I will say something is because when he did that, all you saw was black smoke coming out. So like, who are you trying to impress with what? And if you are trying to impress with something, to impress somebody with what? You ain't nothing, man! You think you can have for me with that little piece of garbage? You probably could, because I'm not feeling myself anyways. He maybe could. Again, black smoke everywhere. What, what am I supposed to do? You're giving me lung cancer over here, homie. I'd rather smoke a joint than nah, I. Nah, I was gonna say I'd rather smoke a cig. I'm not really doing that. Look at him blazing it. It's like he's kicking up dirt, but he's not. He's just kicking up smoke fumes. I can now he kicked up dirt, but you guys get what I mean. Dude, we could blaze him so easily, but I'm not in that. I'm not in that mindset right now. Look at him go. See, that should be a reason right there. You guys should be able to tell that your homie isn't feeling like he usually feels. If he's riding so cool, calm, and collect when someone a homie's blazing it. Also because it's a one lane. Oh, his exhaust smells so gross. Yeah, it's, it's one lane anyway, so blaze all you want. You're not going to get anywhere besides ahead of me. 
Uh, I can still catch up because he can overtake people. I can overtake people. He cannot. He cannot. Ah, Mike. Mm. I don't know why I said Mike. Mike has no significance in my life, but I said Mike. I don't know why. Oh, hold on. See, I'm just letting everybody pass you, man. Because I don't know what the hell is happening behind me. We could have the goddamn apocalypse happen right the goddamn behind me. A zombie could be on my booty trying to get a meat and grab some meat, and I wouldn't even know. Because I can't see behind me, man. But what we do know is he got Rick Rose playing. Ricky Rose ain't playing. That's what I do know. Who's fed cheeseburger eating self? It's playing in my ears right now, man. Smoking dough. I'm on my cell phone. Nine peas. Straight eight balls. Bitch, I got eight balls. The soft white. Still independent. See, is that racist that he says distribution Mexican? Hmm? I can say stuff like that. He, nah, he can. He can say it too. My bad. My bad. My bad. My bad. He can say it too. Me and two women. Rock, Rick, 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 uh, Rick Ross will crush, crush them both. Put five women under them, we'll crush them all. Like, literally. I'm selling dope straight off the iPhone, homie. But how is that? How is that, uh, how is that, uh, you know, how are you stunning on me if you, uh, selling dope off of an iPhone? You know? In case you guys are wondering what song it is, in nine piece. What up, though? I'm talking white girls, Marilyn Monroe. I can get them for the sweet 16. Call it HD flat screen. Leave them dead in the living room. Get it? Leave them dead in the living room. He's gone. That Beamer is gone. I like Rick Ross, but I've never been like a diehard fan of Rick Ross. Well, I've never been a diehard fan of anybody, but you guys get what I mean. I've never been like, <laughs> I want to like eat him up. I've never been like that with Rick Ross. Ricky Rose. I don't know. He never been my cup of tea. He never been my cup of purple drink. You see that instead of saying cup of tea? Cup of purple drink? Cup of purple drink? Say that five times. Step down. See, there's nobody behind me. I'm over here riding like I got, you know, freaking 30 people behind me. I got nobody behind me, man. Nine piece. Straight eight balls. Look at this, man. It's been raining so much. Mexico has been getting greener and greener. There's a big marijuana plant right there. I don't know, I'm just saying. Could be, you never know. I could be wrong, could be right, you never know. Have you literally seen one out there? And have you not seen one out there? Either way, I could be right. California Love playing now by Tupac and Dr. Dre. Another, another unpopular opinion of mine. Not a big fan of Dr. Dre. DRE got me heated, my words like a penitentiary something. Hidden something where it's most needed. Money and weed, Alize and Hennessy. To my thug homies in lockdown, witness me. That's not even the song, that's not even the lyrics that are playing in my ear right now. But I'm ripping it and I'm slapping it in your guys' face. But I'm trying to say that DRE, he never got me heated. His words never hit me like a penitentiary dick. Hitting chicks where it's most needed. That's never been with me, man. That's never been like that for me. Like, I respect him. He's brought a lot to the rap game, the hip hop uh, world. But he's, he's never been my kind of guy. You guys are wondering, hey, say it, you ignorant slut. Why would you say something like that? Give us an example of how much you dislike him. Never said I dislike him. I just don't vibe with him. Yeah, he has like, you know, what is the next episode? Or he has like a couple of good ones out there. But like, besides that, I don't really, I don't really have with him. To the point that, yeah, I know his lyrics on California Love. I know his lyrics from Still Dre. I know his lyrics from, uh, what is it, three episodes, back episode, four episodes, um, something like that. I know all that stuff, but it's sometimes to the point where I'm not listening to California Love. I can't do it right now. If I'm listening to California Love right now, what I would really do is I'd just skip over Dre's part and go straight to Tupac. That's, that's how I kind of treat Dre. When I'm winning, I can't hear Broly so freaking loud. I can't hear it, but I think uh, Tupac's part is coming. Wait. I'm gonna rap it to you guys. Shake it, shake it. I think it's all right. Wait. I can't hear, man. Bro, what the hell up, man? Shorty yelling in my ear, man. My side, homie. I can't pick up what he's saying. This ride is what we do. I don't think that's the part he's on. The bum beat from Jay. Let me serenade the streets of LA. With the Mac now. I don't know. I can't hear what he's saying. I wanted to rap alongside of him, but I can't. I, I hear some lyrics and then I start rapping it, and then I listen closely, and he's not even on that part. 
And then I listened really closely and it's called me maybe, that's what's playing in my ears. And there was California love. Man, that beamer left us. That beamer zipped out of here. But I'm gonna make this into one long video because honestly I can't be bothered with this ride. This ride is not it did not go as I wanted it to go at all. But yeah, I don't know. Dre just not he's never been my kind of rapper. Plus, he wasn't really from my era either, so you know, can you guys really have put me that way? Not, maybe. He's never been that kind of person for me. But you say Tupac is older, but Tupac has been more famous than Dre. Even though originally I'm from Cali, I don't know, I just can't, I can't F with him. I don't know. Pay me if you want me to, but let it be what it be. I think we got Nelly playing now. If you wanna take a little ride with me to the hill of the back to the BC, so I'm the Dude, I forgot how fast she is, man. And one thing I love about owning three bikes, the coolest thing ever is that they're all different in power levels. All right, they're all Saiyans, but they're all different in power levels. They're all Super Saiyans, but they're all different in power levels. So no matter what I ride, when I jump on a different bike, it's a whole new adventure. It's like I'm riding it for the very first time. And I love that so much, man. And this isn't even full power, man. This is the lowest power level that Broly could output. And look at her, man. She just screams. Oh my God. Also, no earplugs. If I wear earplugs, then I can't listen to music. But it's hard to listen to music while riding Broly because she's exhausted. She's just so damn loud. She moans so damn loud. So like, it's one of those conundrums in my life where do I want to listen to music? All right, do I want to listen to music? Okay, but then the Broly's going to be too loud. I'll be barely able to listen to it. But with Rubra, the crappy helmet that is, you can't really change songs or the, the, the volume that easily anyways with gloves. My Senna used to be on the side of my helmet, so it was super easy to change. But this song isn't, but we'll, we'll get a Senna. We'll rip off that um, Rue Rock thingy and we'll put a Senna up in the song. Because yeah, I can't be bothered with this. I really cannot be bothered with this. The main thing you want to, you need for a Senna is just to be able to have it out, put into your helmet. You have to have the ear holes. I have the ear holes in this helmet, so I'll be easily able to swap them out and rip this hole out and freaking shred it to pieces. Shred it to mother effing pieces, homie. See now I would go vroom 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 but I don't know what's happening behind me so can't do that. So we're just gonna ride like a little nice boy that we are. And Broly, you know what? Kick it up. Broly, kick it up. Broly, kick it up. Nobody behind us man, I could have so much fun. Thank you. Ho. Choose a damn lane. Ho. Quit playing with my feelings. Ho. Quit playing with my heart. Ho. Hashtag Backstreet Boys. Actually, Bashy Boys and NSYNC, they both have songs about gamage, gaming with the hearts. Ah Watch this. Again, no idea what's happening behind me. I'm just believing that there's nothing happening behind me right now. The only thing is that I really thought that I could ride like this without any mirrors, that it'd be so easy and simple. But it's just not my riding style, man. Unless I'm on the track, then I don't want mirrors. McLaren. Yeah, she's too damn loud, man. No way in hell am I ever gonna be able to listen to music on this hoe. I might as well just put earplugs and be my own music. Ooh, is that an M8? I think it's an M8. I don't know, I don't know what's happening behind me, but I'll take it. That's an M8.
too fast, man. She's too fast, man. Man, who knew mirrors were so important? Who, who goddamn knew this, man? Somebody could have told me this beforehand. That mirrors are super important. I wouldn't have done what I did. But I did what I've done, and I have to live with it. I have to live with it. Again, I could zoom. But then I have to turn to my right to look if there's somebody coming or not. And I just... I ain't feeling it right now, man. I is not feeling it right now. I had such high hope for these, uh, for this, uh, the ride. And the reason I say that is because I got to put this bike up and I got to remove the panels and start wrapping it. So I wouldn't have one good final ride on this. And that just was a slap in the face, wasn't it? This thing is too damn powerful, man. This should not be legal. This should not be legal in any shape, way, sort, form. I don't know. Shape, way, or form, sort, form. This should not be legal. This hoe. Oh, it's crazy. This thing is insane, man. Oh, look at the AMG Coupe. It's a sedan, right? Four doors. They call it a coupe. One of the stupidest things. All right, homies and homets. Just wanted to show you guys the bike real quick. This might, I'm not 100% sure, but this might be the last. Shut the hell up, Pimp C. All right, yeah. So, sorry, I have Pimp C in my mouth and my ears yelling it out. All right, guys, so the ride wasn't what I wanted it to be. It was just, it's just not. I need mirrors, too much traffic, and I didn't want this to be the last ride on Broly the way that I wanted it to be. Um, we're going to be putting the bike under the wraps. Man, I feel so freaking funky right now. But as I rip off the fairings to do the wrap, I'm gonna do panel by panel, put it on. I'm gonna be recording that process because when you're wrapping, putting a camera and then recording yourself wrap is just a headache. It is, truly is. I tried to do when I did it was wrapping the R6 Kakarot, and it just didn't go as planned because it just it was it was it was getting in the way. Um, so yeah, I'll be and as the panels come off, it'll be easier for me to put other stuff onto the bike that I need to remove panels for two birds one stone kind of thing or two chicks one stone kind of thing or two chicks one kiss kind of thing so we got the tail tidy right there i already showed you guys all this stuff in the build episode we got tail tidy in the back we got the um turn signals done over here as well i love them when you press the hazards they all blink together everything works perfectly it's an amazingly beautifully engineered product um link again is in the description below under honorable mentions just parts things companies i work with that i want to mention um so that stuff is there if you guys want to check it out um v4 broly 2019 what else do we do we got the radiator guard the oil cooler guard um we got the uh aem levers i still gotta adjust this you adjust it from right here and i need to do that because see how how stiff that hoe is i gotta figure out how am i supposed to adjust this but yeah i gotta turn this to adjust both of them brake i think is fine we just gotta adjust the clutch friction zone is like way out there we haven't done a lot because again they're just every bike has stuff that i need to work on and it's just it's a lot and i still got other like companies that want me to want to send me stuff but i'm kind of like you know hesitant on that right now because there's just so much that i haven't done yet on the bike that i want to kind of wrap up stuff from other companies before i take on new companies but at the same time i'd rather just have all the parts with me so i can plan it better i like doing things you know accordingly um, we still got a lot of work to do on the R6. We still got a lot of work to do on um, Nimbus as well. But yeah, just wanted to give you guys an overview how the bike looks like. Just wanted to go on a final ride. I just noticed that a bolt is missing. Oh my god. Yeah, this bolt right here is missing. I guess I didn't tighten it down all the way. It's cool. I can order another one. That's like, what, <laughs> 50 cents? The mods, you'll see a build episode for each one of them. Every single thing that I will do to this bike, besides wrapping it, is going to be... Uh, uh, video is going to be made hope you guys enjoyed it i'm sorry about the, the the crash enthusiasm my voice is really sore from yesterday's ride but overall just this is it i'm just this is what i can give this is the best thing i can give you right now but the cool thing is you guys get to see the new camera or not the new camera but then you continue seeing the new um uh angle that we're, we're using i think that looks really amazing and you'll like it um, stay tuned for more build episodes stay tuned for more outtakes of r6 i'm still working on that it's a very tedious editing process hopefully i have a better sound system because I, ha I have the senna at home i just have to transfer from one helmet to another helmet to put it on this one 
but yeah hopefully you won't see red anymore hopefully the wrap one goes well and then i can share that with you guys as well yeah don't be like me learn from my lessons ride with mirrors it's really important to know what's happening in your surroundings and not knowing that really impacts the way you ride it seriously impacts the way that you ride so we'll get bar ends i have that at home we'll install those and then we'll go on our way you'll see an episode for everything as always this is riding insane i love you guys so much thank you guys so much for the support that you guys continuously give me and all the kind messages i'm trying my best to reply to all the dms there's just so many i have hundreds and hundreds of unread dms over so many weeks that i've just been so lazy about um but yeah thank you guys for everything subscribe only because you love me because i love you and i am out this is riding insane peace